Morning boys. Uh, Wednesday morning. It's a little after two. I've had no sleep. I'm in the chaser, as you can see from the disco. Just on my way down to the shop. I'm gonna start doing some more work on that focus. Ah, seems like the perfect time to get it done. The temperature's cooled right off. I should be doing this, sleeping during the day and then working during the night, because it's lovely at the minute. It is 16 degrees, nice and cool, but it feels like summer. So we're gonna get on with the hedge unit first off, get the cables connected up to it, get the old one, out or the rest of it out but run the mic got to run a DAB aerial get all that taken out properly <clears throat> uh, and then I can start probably measuring up and cutting wood but I've got to get in get the garage emptied move the cars around and then start getting that new Alpine in the dash I do actually like we have got a fascia kit to change but um, I do actually like the black surround that's in there. It's got like a piano black surround, like a shiny one. Um, we'll see which one I like, whether we go for the matte plastic or whether we go for the shiny plastic. Um, I think the car has a lot of shiny decals on it. Oh, nice and quiet on the roads. <laughs> hope you're good, hope you're well. We're on 26.13 on subscribers already. Had a few more soldiers joined and I've noticed a few new names in the comment section. So morning boys, welcome. Thanks for pressing that button. Hope you're enjoying the content. If you are, give it a like, give it a thumbs up, share it. Send it out with everyone else so we can get more boys on the channel, maybe more girls, whichever. But nice little drive off to work and I will uh, catch up with you when I get there. See you in a bit. really nice being in here so early because it's nice and peaceful and outside it's just me and the seagulls but it's really cold out here literally as you walk in here it's like walking into an oven it's mad the difference in temperature change I reckon it's still 26 27 in here it's a well insulated building we're just gonna leave the door open for a minute just to let the heat out so I can get on with some work and not start sweating before we've even begun the day uh, but we'll get on with the focus. We'll see you in a bit, everyone. Right then, first thing I need to do, so we've got a new kit here, new fascia. Um, now, because this is a single din, I just need to basically mark out with these new brackets. The old one is kind of like a push fit in through a plastic cage, whereas this one we want to bolt in. So I'm just going to try and adjust everything to go on here. See in a bit. I've got to say it boys, I prefer the piano black face show, so we're gonna go with this one because it just, it looks nicer on the radio, I think. Um, modified the bracket on the side because Matey Boy drilled so many holes to get it to fit because he had these plates upside down, um, but now they're secure, they're located. But let's get on with building this bad boy up. See in a bit. Right, we've got our kit made. And I've even found a piano black pocket as well to match the outer. So there's our radio fixed in. Um, our loom is done. Just got to put in the microphone and the GPS aerial and we can power this bad boy up and see what he looks like. Happy days. Bah. Morning boys. Um, what are we at now? Seven o'clock. Just got back in. Cheers. Been home, had a shower, seen the kids. Let's crack on. See you in a bit. So I'm just finalising the install of the uh, the Alpine, and I'm looking at this drive. So this is for um, Alpine do their own range in dash cams, front and rear, basically, and that's what this is for. It comes in a camera box, um, and you've got like the signal in to be able to view stuff on the head unit. And I'm looking going, well, we've got a reverse camera in the car that was here previous. That one there. This is not the audio cable. This is the actual camera. Um, and I'm kind of looking at this going, where do we connect the reverse camera to? Apparently you need another, need another thing. So to have a direct camera input into this, 
you've got to buy a separate part. So just be warned that if you buy this ILX F11 5D, it's not as simple as it seems. You've got to buy some extras to make the thing do the normal functions, which I think is a bit cheeky, because I bet this thing wasn't cheap. <laughs> hmm, in a bit. Right then my dudes, lunch time is just about to happen. I'm dusty, I'm sweaty, it's getting warm. We've got the start of it, so you've seen me make the bridges to run the amps up in the air. So we can run the cables underneath. We'll paint the inside of this white and then we're gonna illuminate it with LEDs. That then fits in the car on my little support so it's off the floor. Then we've got to make a false floor and then a box at the other side, perspex, trim it, job done. I'm gonna stop sweating and have some lunch. I'll see you in a bit. Everyone, we're just coming back after lunch. So as you can see, I've made some little stays. We've cut out the center section of our deck where the amps are gonna sit. And I'm now gonna just give them a little bit of wood glue to hold them in place. And now we've got all this marked up. I know where everything's gonna be, but this is just gonna replicate the base of the amplifier in the same situation but it means we can basically have the amp up in the air but without looking like it's up in the air and the cables can go straight underneath and out the bottom so it'll look all simple and clean it won't look like there's anything going on but we know there is a little bit cool today Alex is absolutely a baking got the 
this this afternoon. Face gone to London on a school trip. And I'm already hallucinating through tiredness. <laughs> what we like. Things you do, eh? Things we do. It'll be worth it though. It will be worth it. Oh, flat battery. Give me one second. Dudes, a beat. So we've had we're supposed to call off today, but it's been another absolutely blistering hot day. Um, obviously, I'm tired because I was in here early. Um, we've made a stock order, some stuff coming in. Um, the Alpine obviously needs a camera cable because the guy has a reverse camera just there. So we'll be adding the camera cable. So I haven't put the head unit in yet because there's no point. Um, so box wise this is the false floor we have supports which i've made underneath we've got strengthening pads which is going to hold the false floor so i've got the carpet there ready to make a template out of and cut some wood um, everything's gluing we've got a first coat of white paint on I'm using white because i want the the light obviously to be reflected from the neons um, cable and holes underneath and amp support so the amp will sit on top of those two little mounts and the cables will run straight round and underneath so from the top it will just look nice and simple and plain um, keep it as as you know clean I want a clean looking install um, you probably tell by my mannerisms my voice I'm tired I'm hot I'm exhausted and today has just been messy messy wood stuff messy wood stuff um, but I'm going to have a little tidy up because somehow I've got to get two more cars in here. <laughs> yep. Um, and this stuff needs to dry. It needs 24 hours basically. But so far it's white, which is what we wanted to go with that, which is white. Um, I'm toying with the idea on a Perspex design. So obviously one amp is longer than the other. And what I'm kind of thinking is we do almost like a triangle symbol like the Focal Swish. That's where I'm going with this. That's what I think we're gonna end up with. But I have the light reflecting through because it's so white in there. Anyway, um, yeah. Once that's kind of built and ready to go, it can sit in. I can cut a template, make the top um, and fabricate the hole for the Perspex. Obviously we can do the wiring for the amplifier and then we're basically building the box. Put the subs in it, tune it, test it, and then refit the head unit and the interior stuff, which is still hanging out. But that's it. Uh, day three, God. I need some sleep. Um, but I'll see you all bright and early in the morning, hopefully after I've slept. Um, 
we'll see. I may be in here this morning, tomorrow morning again. Um, we'll see how this dries, but it needs needs a little bit of time. It's the problem with emulsion. You can't rush it because it just, yeah, it just becomes sticky. See you in a bit. Bye.